and welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you another awesome figure from hi toys <laughs> it's injustice 2 batman batman yes. variants it says ta-da batman variants so um we want to say a great big thank you to hi toys for sending this batman to us for free to share with you today so these are the one what scale are they? It the is one eighteenth. Um, scale and so yeah, they are like about four inches. And they are pretty articulated for such they a really are little figure. Yeah, they are part of the exquisite mini line. Awesome. So this is part of uh, it says Batman variants. What does it show on the back? Is it two different poses um, of the same? Yeah, I think it's one. two different. Awesome. Let's put it like that. There we go. There you have it. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at does he what he comes with. So it looks like, ooh, he comes with like three batarangs. Right? Yeah, yeah, it looks like he's got yeah, a couple batarangs, the bat grapple, I think that's some extra hands. And I can't, yeah. And then they and always come with an awesome <clears throat> stand. So um, we're going to go ahead and get this Batman out of the box so we can give you a much closer look without all this glare. We'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. And Batman is out of his box. So let's take a closer look. He does come with, uh, like, two extra set of hands. Do they all match? Like, are they all left hand, right hand of the same thing? Um, or? well, these two, they're like, um... Hey, baby. They're okay. like, more like, um, okay, what do you call right it? Oh. Well, I don't think that's the matching one. Oh. I think this is. They're like the same thing. Okay. They're kind of like, you know, like he's got his finger on the trigger. Uh-huh. So I'm guessing that goes with the back grapple. Okay. Um, the other pair, like one is like an open yeah, hand, okay. like one is an open hand. Mm -hmm. The other I thought maybe was like a fist, but it's actually mm -hmm. like a, probably maybe to hold the battering because it does have like a grip uh, to like it. Like a grip right. to it, yeah. Okay, let's take a closer look at him. Whoa, there's his facial sculpt. There's little eyes um, through there. That looks really cool. That had to be really teeny tiny. Yeah. That is so small. I would small. love to see like a video on that. Because his face is smaller than my so small. fingernail. Um, and uh, so there you have, there's um, some like silver detailing just like on along the edges here um, of that part of his armor and running through here on his arm, which is cool. It's just like a little traces of it. Um, and on the tops of I don't ever know what those are called on his gloves, but anyway, on the tops of those. Yeah, I don't know if there's a name. I mean, it, the actual thing itself is like a gauntlet, but I yeah. don't know what those are. But anyway, I think that's cool. Spikes it makes it stand out, especially on display. It's going to reflect the light and help his suit show up better. That's really cool. Um, his, and he's got some under here. You can see the little silver detailing under there. Um, as well as his belt is like um, a deep gold or brass type color. Some silver detailing in there. Um, and I just wanted to be yeah. So he does have the cloth cape. Ooh, this is almost like a, a velveteen. It's a very different feel. Yeah. It's not like a. What do you call it? It is. It's like a, you know, almost like a very thin velvet, which is cool. I'm trying to think of that. Microfiber. It feels like microfiber now that I'm feeling of it. It's not like, like cotton or you right. know, polyester or something. Um, so that's really cool. And there he is. I'll let you show off his articulation. And then okay. we'll take a look at his accessories. Alright, so he has uh, that ankle. He has, of course, the double knee. The, um, like it's kind of hard to see, but you can tell in there, like the up, like the, um, hips. I mean, the upper thigh. Right. You can see it rotate. Yeah. Um, of course, the, uh, like the hips. Um, oops. Then you have the hips, uh, the waist pivot, the upper torso um, pivot, I guess is what you call it. Um, you have the, the shoulder, the elbow, of course the wrists, and then of course his neck articulation so he can look all around. And awesome. He does have a, up, he does have a good range of motion of his neck too. Yeah. Very cool. So yeah, it's it's awesome how much articulation they're able to get into such a small figure. 
And these come with stands with um, one peg on there. Um, there's holes in the bottom of his feet. And also, um, they're colored by um, by who, you know, by the DC character, or the, all the DC Well, like, yeah, like, the uh, all of the Injustice ones have this, like, purple design. Okay. Uh-huh. Um, like, all the Predator ones have the same design on it, so that way you, you can... You yeah, because you can attach them, them. That's why you have the little H's and I's. Well, that's what I call them. Uh, and uh, you put those on there, and then you can attach all the bases, which is awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and show off the world's smallest. <laughs> Pick it up. It's so small and super duper thin, but I want you to see the detailing on this. There's three of them, so luckily they give you extra. But that's super cool. Maybe you can fit one of those. Or his hands actually have, I don't know if we showed it. Um, John said, like, brass knuckles kryptonite yeah, on like there. Yeah, like kryptonite brass knuckles, yeah. Yeah, so um, he has the fist in his hands now. But he uh, he would be able to hold one of those if he had the other hands in. As well as, ta-da! The back grapple. There you have it. Very cool. So he does come with three of those, and that's really awesome because they are so super tiny. We are just like marveling at how how tiny they are. They are really awesome. It's awesome how much detail they're able to put into all this with on such a small scale. Yes, I really like it. I really like the smaller scale. I mean, who you can collect so many more if you yeah. if you're uh, don't have as much room. And um, they can all still come with these awesome accessories. So we want to say another great big thank you to... Hi, it's always. For sending him to us for free to share with you today. He's going to make a great addition to our Hiya Toys collectible figure collection. Yes. So thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.